So in this video we're going to look at the setup um, of the Joomla gallery. Um, it's pretty straightforward, so let's get straight to it. Um, we have a test website here where we're going to install the plugin which has been um, downloaded already. So we're going to go to Manage and Install. And then we're going to install from package file. We're going to find that package file on our system here, which is sitting currently on my desktop. Let's just tidy ourselves up a wee bit. There we go. So we can drag that across and in it goes there. And now it's uploading and now it's installed. Um, once installed, the gallery is under components and we can see it here. Let's immediately get going by um, adding some photos in. Before we do that, we should mention the use of photos within the gallery. It's always best to prepare your photos first. I've already uploaded them to the Joomla website um, in different folder structure. And pr before doing that, I sized images to 1000 pixels wide. And I also reduced the quality of the images. You don't want to upload directly from the camera. Otherwise, you're going to be working with very big files, which will slow down your website. Okay, so let's create our first gallery by clicking New. And we're going to call it Sky. And save. And now our first thing is to create some categories. I'm going to be uploading three sets, or using three sets of um, images. So let's create our first category in a wee moment once it's gone through this little bit here. Um, so we're going to create a category and um, I've already prepared the names. Our first um, category is going to be Talisker. Save. Um, let's add another one. It's going to be Kerrang. Save. And then add one final more category. And it's going to be Fairy Pools. So there are the three categories we're going to be populating with images in a little moment. Once we've created our folder categories, then we can actually import the images into our gallery. So we can use the icon down here where we have two options, either to upload from the computer or um, import from a folder within Joomla. So that's what I'm going to do for now. So I'm going to click on that where we have our folder structure within Joomla. And I'm going to be working with um, the Talisker images first, so we're going to select them all here and click our button here to insert selected items, which will then take those images and import them to our um, Talisker category within our gallery here. Um, I'm now going to go and continue this for um, Kerrang. We'll do exactly the same process from folder, find the correct folder, select all the images and then import. And moving on to Fairy Pools. Um, same process. Um, so we've uploaded um, or imported all of our images into our gallery system and now we can click save. And now we have created our um, first gallery. There's obviously many settings that we can go in and play with, but for now though, let's publish this um, somewhere on the website so we can see how it currently looks. So let's um, save and close out of this. We can see we've got our gallery, which is published um, called Sky, and that's the one we're gonna now import to, um, or inject into one of our Joomla articles. Let's go to the front of the website where we're gonna log in. We could do this from the um, administrator side also, but it's, easy, it's nice to see it being done this way. We're going to edit this particular article, which is our homepage article. Once we've got our WYSIWYG editor, we should see the button at the bottom, bottom here called Gallery. And that's the bit we're going to use. We're going to click on that, where we can see the gallery that we've just created called Sky. We're going to click on that. All right. And now it's in, pasted this little piece of code into um, our article. Now, wherever this code is will be where the gallery is within our article. And I think I'd prefer to have that at the bottom. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut and I'm going to paste that at the bottom. There it is there. And now click Save. All right, and log out. And we can see we've just pasted in um, the code that allowed us to inject our gallery into our article, and here they are.
We can see we've got our three categories of um, Talsker, Kerrang, or Fairy Pools um, all here. And notice how it automatically generated its thumbnails. Um, we have control over the size of the thumbnails, um, and we'll look at that in a further video. Um, if we click on a particular image, then it brings up to our full size. And notice we've got lots of different control um, tools um, at the top here, which we can choose to turn off if we wish to. So that's how we can import or inject um, a gallery system into a Joomla article um, using our system here. Hopefully this is helpful for you.